at the space station, our journey begins. The expedition is comprised of six ships. Time, a few minutes before departure. Final checks are being completed. At zero hour, the thrust chambers are fired. We are underway. Our fleet climbs beyond the space station, beginning its outward spiral around the Earth. speed is increasing steadily. After four months and 17 days, 850,000 miles out, the expedition finally escapes the Earth's gravity. six months, 14 days, our speed has increased to 75,000 miles per hour. Mars is steadily increasing in size. The halfway point has been reached. The thrust chambers are reversed. Deceleration begins. The Earth grows smaller. At seven months, 24 days, Crew members witness a spectacular passage of the Earth across the face of the sun. Three months later, the expedition is 700,000 miles above Mars, and the 45-day spiral in toward the planet is begun. Now, for the first time, the tiny Martian moons Deimos and Phobos are visible to the unaided eye. As we move to within 4,000 miles of Mars, we get a close-up view of the moon Phobos. After 13 months and six days, our voyage to Mars is finally completed. The ships are orbiting 620 miles above the surface of the planet. Before exploration begins, test missiles are fired to sample the strange new atmosphere. Now the first landing craft is moved into position to attempt the hazardous 600-mile drop to the Martian surface. This is a crucial moment. man finally walks upon the sands of Mars, what will confront him in this mysterious new world? Will any of his conceptions of strange and exotic Martian life prove to be true? Will he find the remains of a long dead civilization? Or will the more conservative opinions of present day science be borne out with the discovery of a cold and barren planet where only a low form of vegetable life struggles to survive. These questions will be answered by our space pioneers of the future. In solving the enigma of the red planet Mars, man may find a key that opens the first small door to the universe. Carried forward on the wings of modern science, 
man in the years that follow may discover the miracle of life as it exists in all its countless forms throughout an infinite creation.